Hello, my name is Anant Godbole, and I have the privilege of leading the ETSU subcontract awarded to us by the Naiswanger Foundation. We have a team consisting of graduate students and faculty from um, a variety of academic departments. Our goal is to bring novel fields to the area of STEM education. And uh, what we have um, chosen for this year are the biomedical public health field of epidemiology, artificial intelligence. We have trainings in um, school culture for administrators, and then we have a group doing uh, public relations. Hello, I'm Chris Bowen, District STEM Specialist for Johnson City Schools and adjunct faculty member for ETSU. Along with my colleague, Rachel Bruyette, I co-facilitate the Nicewanger STEM LD workshop on epidemiology. During this workshop, we teach participants research-based instructional strategies, including storylines, phenomenon-based instruction, and argumentation. We focus these strategies around epidemiological concepts to ensure that students are learning relevant, real-world science while using problem-based and analytical strategies. Hello, my name is Dr. Ariel Cintron Arias. I am an applied mathematician at East Tennessee State University. And I'm going to debrief you about our initiative, Artificial Intelligence Ambassadors of Northeast Tennessee. AI can be defined as a discipline that involves creating computational tools for making predictions and decisions. Our initiative intends to improve diversity and equity in artificial intelligence occupations. One of the demographics that's currently underrepresented in AI occupations is that of low-income Americans that reside in rural communities. According to the U.S. Department of Labor, occupations that involve artificial intelligence skills have very favorable forecasts over the decade 2020 to 2030. So efforts can target occupations that build digital infrastructure centered around AI technologies. Hello, I'm Dr. Ginger Christian, and I want to introduce myself and our team to you. Dr. Virginia Foley, Mr. Scott Lamy, and I will be working with you. Specifically, Dr. Foley and I will work to support school admin teams and teacher leader teams on school improvement plans, school culture, climate, and long-term strategic planning. We look forward to working with you very soon. I'm Dr. Jennifer Price, Assistant Dean in the College of Arts and Sciences and Professor of, Bi of Biology at East Tennessee State University. We're here to introduce ourselves as the Public Relations and Community Outreach Team for the Nice Wonger Grant. My name is Ellie, and I am a graduate assistant. I'm thrilled to be a part of this program and to provide support in any way that I can. Thanks, yeah. Ellie. I'm Dr. Megan Quinn, and I'm an associate professor in the Department of Biostatistics and Epidemiology in the College of Public Health at ETSU. And as part of the PR and Community Outreach Team, our mission is to inform the public, our affiliated partners, and social media followers of the origin and overall aims of this grant, along with some of the details of each of the subcomponents. We'll also share the measurable impacts of grant activities. So we plan to work with university relations on a regular basis to generate press releases. We plan to create teacher bios and spotlights for participating teachers. We're going to create a YouTube channel for compiling and sharing short videos. And finally, we're gonna work with our university advancement team to try to raise money for teacher stipends.